got all the slime in the world. So, where's our slime monster? Vampire. Ah, uh, vampires. Maybe it's the Downtown Express? Sounds like a lair. Sounds like... Side of vamp over easy. Not so easy for the vamp. Oh, gross, Eddie. It's hard to know who to root for in these parasite versus parasite situations. Parasite? A demonically possessed symbiote? With a vampire's bloodlust. Not good. Come on, Eddie, don't do this. They are definitely doing this. <laughs> Energy from every pore! Don't lose it, pal. Either of you. He is lost. One mercy remains. Ah, yes. The elimination of one tormented soul for the good of many. Humans do love a moral dilemma. The umami of an otherwise flavorless existence. Mephisto. Gesundheit. Uh, nice mullet. Go to hell. There's nowhere I would rather be, but I've come on business. So let's make a deal. Is this one of those fiddle at the crossroads scenarios, or? No deal. My terms are as follows. I spare venom. I cure the symbiote of Lilith's demonic touch. I end the blood fever he's given himself, gorging on curdled vampire bile. I wretched little thinking of it. I said, no deal. All this, and I ask but one inconsequential thing in return. Stop the vampire uprising. The undead are bad for business. So you cure Eddie and we keep doing what we've been doing? Yes. Wipe them out. Remove every trace of their foul scourge from the earth. Then I will cure this pathetic creature. Forever. For the last time, no. Hold up. Give me the fine print. Nothing much. The usual. If you should fail, you'll discover something far more threatening than the undead, namely all truly, etc., etc., immortal soul, yada yada. This is a bad idea. This or he dies? We don't have much of a choice. I'm in. Good. Just sign there and there. You may feel a little steep. We should follow. You do have a vampire war to wage. Oh, and Peter, I'll see you around. How did he know my... Huh. <laughs>
that. Eddie? Well, this is awkward. You are the man in the monster? Something like that. So, you okay, Eddie? Blood! <laughs> it's kidding, little joke. Uh, no, I, I come in peace. For once. Really? New kids gotta get in on this, too? Hey, by the way, you're killing it out there. Respect. Thank you. Not my first vampire war. Eddie, are you... yourself again? Well, you mean, are we... ourselves? Yeah, Lilith. She made us a monster. We did awful things. You know that's not who we are, right? Of course. So I'm sitting here. Well, in there, and thinking. <clears throat> I saw what you did for me. So, how about we put aside all our, uh, you know, personal stuff? Okay. No, not forever. Just, just until this whole messed up vampire situation is figured out. Till all the innocent people are safe. I mean, that would make sense, wouldn't it? Yeah. I don't know. Works for me. Shake on it. Oh. Huh. Wait a sec. Put her there, partner. I'm there, partner. Welcome to the Midnight Suns. one may choose to save the odd civilian. Contractually, in the fight to end the vampire scourge, the spirit of the intended agreement... Oh, come again! I did not waste my time curing you so you could save superfluous human lives. Yeah, still boring. Do I have your attention now? We all know what you really are. A monster. The only version of you that remotely interests me, and the only reason I allowed this deal. Stop doing that! Oh, I'll stop. But you've earned an object lesson. Vampires are bad for business. Vampires keep souls from flowing to where they're most needed. And with less souls, there are more soulless. Do you understand the lesson? because it's time for some target practice. Mm, so many targets. I just see two of them. You've earned some small measure of my respect. And I hope learned your lesson. The lesson is, we do not like being in the dark out. Of course you don't. And that burning in your chest, that would be... Uh, indigestion. That would be regret. The most overused human seasoning. Seasoned humans are delicious. Would you? Enough! If you want this so much, Stop posturing and tell us where to go. Find what you seek, where it all began. Now, eradicate the vampire threat, or join me in limbo forever. You do not dare! Right off you go. 
I don't know why I bother. What's going on, Ed? Got to thinking. Mephisto said I would find what I seek where it all began. Gotta be here, right? I guess this church is the place where I lose things, and you find them. Any luck? A whole lot of nothing. What's eating at you? I caused a mountain to hurt. In the name of some... freaky demon lady? Lilith. She controlled you, Eddie. She didn't do all this. I did. Look around. I'm never gonna clean this mess up. Never gonna make any of this right. You don't know that. Oh. You know me. I screw everything up. Maybe I deserve this curse. My Aunt May says the easiest way to let the darkness win is to do nothing. Yeah, well, I don't have an Aunt May. All I get is this. Whole lot of... Watching someone else get to be the good guy. Must be nice. You okay, Parker? I gotta say, something's setting my spidey sense off. Kinda jacked up to maximum overdrive here. It's all about boundaries, Parker. Gotta put that thing on mute sometimes. Maybe someday, but this is different. It feels like... Vampires. You got my back? I got yours. Brothers in vamp slime. Let's do this. After you, Eddie. After us. Catacombs are older than the church. Look, Hemalisks. We are looking down. Could be eating. This could be the source of the whole vampire infestation. Uh oh, that's not a small entrance. Infestation! Infestation! Prince of Darkness? Wait, you mean... The Father of Death. So to be clear... The Impaler. Humanity itself is the infestation. You insect. Okay, first, arachnids aren't insects. Don't feel bad. It's a common misconception. Second, Love the costume. Seriously, I dressed like you last Halloween. That is no costume. Crap. Enough of this! that social cue my children 
You think this stops my plans? Today, your only gain is an immortal enemy. Much better. Now, could someone give us a lift out of here? Another deal, then? No! No! Yes! No. Pity. So, aside from the soul hoarding thing, what is the devil's beef with Dracula? He broke his agreement. But I am pleased. We are not! You have made progress. I look forward to what comes next. Eddie can stay Eddie for now. Not to worry. I'll see the rest of you very soon. Hard to believe you were once rivals. Today, I fought beside partners. I guess you're right. It felt good working with you, Eddie. For the first time in forever, I didn't think the symbiote was preparing to devour one of my organs. Yeah, we really sent Dracula packing, huh? And it's a relief to have Mephisto off my back. You're a free man. What's the plan now? Yeah. Free. Uh, Eddie? This is the part where you say, I'm gonna eat two pizzas and sleep for 11 hours. At least, that's what I'd do after a big battle. But knowing the old Parker luck, that's when I'd stumble into a battle with Doc Ock. Eddie, is everything all right? Yeah, 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 I'm fine. And I will be fine. Completely free of Lilith's control. It almost doesn't feel real. Do you want one of us to pinch you? Joking, 